For some 40 years now, we've all sailed together, sometimes as skipper and often as crew. In sunshine and calms and through rough stormy weather, we've sailed to the south where green waters turn blue. All the stories and anecdotes trip off the tongue of that one close encounter we had with the whale, of the bottles we've emptied and the songs that we've sung, and the longer the time that's gone past, then the taller the tale. Remember the night we made passage to France, poor Fred was so seasick and John lay and snored, and when Roger sang right through the Pirates of Penzance, we debated which one of the three should be first overboard. We sailed in the sun where the waters were warm and we've yarned through the night with the side lights aglow. But now half the crew's weathered the storm. They've finished their trick, gone off watch, and they've turned in below. For we've seen a few suns rise up out of the sea and a few hundred more set down in the west. But of all of the shipmates who sailed with me, I can honestly say, lads, that you were the best. There's Mike, and there's Chris, Fred, Will, and John Bright. They've served out their time, and they've gone on before, leaving the rest of us crew here behind, standing the evening watch here on the shore. And when my life reaches the end of the road, we'll all meet in the sunset on that final quayside, and we'll let go the warps, see the anchor is stowed, and we'll sail down the ebb at the turn of the tide. And who cares who skipper? And we'll all be the crew. For the north wind blows cold and the east wind blows keen. But we'll sail to the south, where green waters turn blue. And we'll reach down the west wind to Fiddler's Green. <laughs>